forget batteries, forget hydrogen. Mazda is bringing an engine to America that runs on gasoline but is ignited by high-powered lasers. This isn't science fiction. They have replaced the 100-year-old spark plug with a 9mm laser beam for insane precision, promising more power, better efficiency, and fewer emissions from their legendary rotary engine. Is this the most brilliant innovation in internal combustion history or the last glorious roar of a dying technology? And could this laser-powered beast actually rival an EV? We're about to find out. If you think the future of cars is set in stone, you'll want to subscribe to Electric Vehicle Empire because it's about to get complicated. In an era where electric is the only word on every automaker's lips, where battery gigafactories are the new cathedrals of industry, one company is making a bet that seems… insane. While the world zigs towards silent, instant torque, Mazda is zagging. They're not just reviving a dead engine technology, they're strapping a laser to it and aiming it straight at the heart of the US market. This is the story of the rotary engine's impossible comeback, a high-tech resurrection powered by literal beams of light. It's a tale that challenges everything we thought we knew about the future of performance. The Legend of a Flawed Genius The Rotary Engine For car enthusiasts, the name alone brings a smile. No pistons, no crankshafts, just a spinning triangular rotor that creates a symphony of high RPM fury. It's a marvel of engineering, compact, lightweight, and capable of producing immense power from a small displacement. Mazda was its champion, the only major automaker bold enough to build its legacy around this unique design. But the rotary was a flawed genius. It was notoriously thirsty for both fuel and oil, and its emissions well, let's just say they weren't exactly friendly to polar bears. As emission standards tightened across the globe, the rotary's flame began to flicker. The beloved RX-8 was its last stand, and in 2012, the production line went silent. For all intents and purposes, the rotary was dead. Or so we thought. Behind the scenes, Mazda never gave up. They established a dedicated rotary engine development group, a team of true believers tasked with the impossible, redeemed the rotary for the modern age. And their solution is straight out of a sci-fi movie. The Laser Revolution. Goodbye, spark plug. The problem with the rotary, and indeed any internal combustion engine, has always been the spark. For over a century, we've relied on the humble spark plug, a relatively crude device that zaps a mixture of air and fuel into combustion. It's imprecise. The spark can be inconsistent, leading to unburnt fuel, wasted energy, and harmful emissions. Mazda's solution? Get rid of it entirely. At the Tokyo Auto Salon, Mazda dropped a bombshell. Their next-generation rotary will feature laser ignition. Instead of a spark, a tiny, incredibly powerful 9mm laser module will fire a concentrated beam of light into the combustion chamber. This laser creates a plasma explosion, igniting the fuel-air mixture with a level of precision that spark plugs can only dream of. So why is this such a game-changer? First, precision. A laser can be aimed at the absolute perfect spot in the chamber at the exact perfect nanosecond, ensuring a complete and total burn. This means more power is extracted from every single drop of fuel. Second, leaner mixtures. Laser ignition is so powerful, it can ignite fuel-air mixtures that are leaner, meaning they have more air and less fuel. A conventional spark plug would simply fail to ignite such a mixture. Burning lean lowers combustion temperatures, which dramatically reduces the formation of harmful pollutants like NOx. Third, higher compression. This technology allows for much higher compression ratios without the risk of engine knock. For Mazda, the masters of high-compression sky-active engines, this is the holy grail. Higher compression equals higher efficiency and more torque. That's the push-you-back-in-your-seat feeling we all crave. And finally, durability. High-compression engines are notoriously hard on spark plugs. A laser ignition system, with no electrodes to wear down, is built to last. This isn't just an upgrade. It's a fundamental reinvention of how internal combustion works. 
It's taking a technology known for being dirty and inefficient and potentially making it one of the cleanest and most efficient combustion designs on the planet. An ICE gamble in an EV world. This all sounds incredible, but it begs a massive question. Why? Why pour hundreds of millions of dollars into perfecting internal combustion when the entire industry, pushed by governments and consumer demand, is racing towards an all-electric future? This is where Mazda's strategy gets fascinating. They aren't anti-EV, they have hybrids and are developing their own electric platforms, but they believe the end of the internal combustion engine has been greatly exaggerated. They see a future where multiple technologies coexist. While EVs are great for daily commuting, they still face challenges with range, charging infrastructure, battery production ethics, and weight. Mazda is betting that there will still be a strong market for a highly efficient, thrilling, and cleaner combustion engine, especially for performance-oriented vehicles where lightweight design and emotional connection are paramount. The laser-ignited rotary isn't a rejection of the future. It's an attempt to build a different future. It's a statement that innovation isn't exclusive to batteries and electric motors. By tackling the core problems of emissions and efficiency head-on with groundbreaking tech, Mazda is arguing for the soul of the automobile, the sound, the feel, the mechanical heartbeat that many fear will be lost in the silent electric age. This engine, destined for the U.S. market, could power a new-age sports car, a successor to the legendary RX line. It could be a lightweight, high-revving marvel that offers a driving experience no EV can replicate. It's a bold, risky, and incredibly exciting gamble. Will it pay off, or is it the last beautiful swan song for one of history's most iconic engines? Only time will tell. What do you think? Is Mazda's laser rotary a work of genius or a fool's errand? Let us know your unfiltered thoughts in the comments below. And for more deep dives into the technologies that are shaping the future of transportation, make sure you're subscribed to Electric Vehicle Empire.